We've got stripped out threads on the inside of the aluminum casting here. I can thread this bolt in and at first it feels like it's threading in nicely until it gets all the way to the end. Then it just never tightens up. It just continues spinning. There's no threads for it to grab on. We'll take off the part. You can see how messed up the threads are. Here's what the threads are supposed to look like. These are in good condition. We'll clean up the threads. And now we'll clean it out with a brush with some rubbing alcohol. We're gonna use some JB Weld and we're gonna mix it on some plastic here because we don't want the resins to soak into the cardboard. You want a 50-50 mix of the hardener and the resin. Mix it up really good so it's one consistent color. Our work time is pretty high on this because this is 24 hour JB Weld. Clean the bolt with rubbing alcohol as well. We'll dip it in automatic transmission fluid as a mold release. Put in our JB Weld. Make sure you get all the way down in there. Thread the bolt in place. Now let it sit for 24 hours. It's now the next morning, so this is hardened. It's not cured yet, but we're gonna go ahead and remove the bolt, and then before we torque it, we're gonna make sure we let it sit a full 24 hours before we really put any kind of torque on it. Okay, seems to be coming out easy. There's definitely some deeper threads in there. Now we're gonna let this cure and I'll be interested to see how well it torques. It's been 24 hours plus, so we can go ahead and torque this into place. It feels like it's going in nicely, but the true test will be whenever we put torque on the bolt. The torque spec on this bolt is 18 foot-pounds, so hopefully we'll be able to get that high. I'm gonna use this electronic torque wrench here so we can see exactly at what point it will fail. If it gets up to 18 foot-pounds, I'll stop but if it starts slipping anywhere in between, I'll stop there and we can take a look at where it failed. Let's start torquing. We're starting to build a little bit of torque there, two foot pounds, three, four, Five? I'm not sure, it might be starting to slip at this point. Yeah. Looks like that's about as high as we're able to get. I can start to feel it slip now, it's starting to strip out. So our final was 4.9, right now it says 4.1. So does JB Weld really work for stripped aluminum threads? I'd say not really. We cleaned up the threads nicely, we gave it more than 24 hours to cure, and we only got about five foot-pounds out of it.